regrading using the CDO. Regrading is the process of interpolating from the one grid resolution to a different grid resolution. It involves temporal, vertical and the spatial, that is the horizontal interpolation. There are the numerous grid interpolation methods and users should choose the method appropriate for the intended task. Climate grids are the georeference on a sphere where the pole singularities and the convergence of the longitude meridians can be issues that need to be the address. So there are the different kinds of or the data sets which follow the grid in the climate research. So grid use in the climate research fall into several categories the regular, rectilinear, curvilinear, unstructured. Regular where the grid mainly appear in the finite difference method. Rectilinear grid coordinate are the one dimensional and in curvilinear grid coordinates are the two dimensional. In the unstructured here the grid coordinates require a list of the nodes connectivity information. <coughs> Why the variety of grids needed? A simple answer to the advances in the computer capabilities, computational efficiency, addressing the pole singularities and the physical constraints. So there are many regrading methods. First, classic interpolation method include the bilinear, nearest neighbor, inverse distance, spline, binding, spectral and triangulation. The most commonly used methods of the climate grid interpolation is bilinear. The bilinear method is easy to program and apply when the source and the destination grid are in a rectilinear. However, the curvilinear and the unstructured grids may involve sophisticated searching algorithm to determine the points surrounding the location to be interpolated. Let's suppose take the 3 degree by 3 degree grid resolution data set. So you just command the CDO grid desk and the input file name. So the display will show that. So here the grid type represent the lawn lat. This is in rectilinear form data set. If the data set in curvilinear then instead of lawn lat there is a curve linear. After that the grid size 7320. It is the multiplication of the x size and the y size. X size represent the longitude and the y size represent the latitude. Here so the 7320 is the multiplication of 120 and the 61. Now the x size represent the longitude or the globe with the 3 degree resolution and the y size represent the 61 or the 3 degree resolution. So x in here 3 and the y in minus 3. Now I have to store this target grid source in a file. So just put the command cdo grid des input file name greater than sign and the any file name with the grd. So you can put the any extension. Here I put the grd extension. Now you will get the this display. So I want to convert this 3 degree by 3 degree grid resolution data set into 1 degree by 1 degree. So I am going to make some changes into the source file. So just open this source file which saved into the same directory. Now make some changes here the grid size. So for 1 degree 1 degree so latitude and the longitude latitude should be the 3 181 and the longitude is the 360 so the multiplication will be the 65160 again make some changes with the x size and y size for 1 degree by 1 degree you just put the longitude 360 and latitude is a 181 now some make change in x ink and y ink 
save it this file and run this command cdo remap bil see this is the bilinear interpolation if the data set is in a curvilinear form then the command will be different that time remap bic okay so here the bilinear interpolation here the rectilinear form data set so i using the bilinear interpolation directly after comma without giving any space just put the source file name comma space input file name and the output file name with extension so you'll get the display of the processing so now <clears throat> the data of output file will be saved in the same directory now the visualization of the 3 degree by 3 degree resolution with any visualization software just see the special resolution so for 1 degree and 1 degree here you see the difference between the grid resolutions between the coarser and the finer 